There's a prophet showing you that if you take all the years, you take the years of Israel as a day, 5,775 and divided by the age of Jesus was when he was crucified and rose again. To get all the years as Abraham lived, 175 years, on the Genesis chapter 25, verse 7. And the prophet showing you if you take the year 2015 divided by 33. It was all the years that Jesus lived before he was crucified and rose again. Clearly you can make out the 666 according to Revelations 13, 18. You see all the 6, 6, and 6 inside the number. Showing that 2015 it's also the number of man and the number of beasts, 666. Six hundred and three score and six. And the man and the number of beasts. You see that when you divide 2015 by 33, all the years Jesus lived before he was crucified and rose again. And this year in 2015, Jesus will appear and judge the world. This is the year 2015 divided by the age of Jesus started his ministry. You see the sixes, you see the six and the seven on each end. God created the earth in six days and rested on the seventh. Connecting this with, the, with Jesus, who is God, that God is looking at this year. Similar to how he looked at creation, but the reverse. I was creating a new heaven and a new earth this year. This old heaven and this old earth will be done away with. Now for all those who disagree, I will show you something. I take 2014 and divide it. By 30, what do you think I'm going to get? A whole different number. I don't get the sixes. <laughs> if I take 2016, for use that for all those that's curious, and divide it by 30, what number do you think I'm going to get? 67.2. But if I take 2015, and I divide it by 30, I get 67.16666667. If I take all the years it's been since Jesus was crucified 1,982 years ago and multiply that, excuse me, divide that by 33, I get, see that, the six zero. Six zero six zero six zero. See the six six six. Jesus was on the cross, everyone, for one hundred and eighty minutes. See that? Six times three is eighteen. Two thousand fifteen added up is eighteen. Jesus is coming this year, everybody. This is all the years it's been since Jesus was crucified, 1,982 years, divided by the age he was when he was crucified and rose again. So, 1,982 years ago, at age 33, Jesus between the 6th and the ninth hour, hung on the cross for 180 180 degrees or 606060. 60 minutes times 3 or 180, 180 minutes. Showing the connection 
with Revelations 13, 18. Let him who have wisdom calculate the number of the beast, for is also the number of man. His number is 600, three score, and six, which is 666. Multiply, excuse me, dividing 1,985 years. Is that 1,985 years? Or 1,985 years ago? Since 2015. Do the 2015, everybody? You are the 15s, the 2 and the 0 right there, and 2 are the 15s. 1,985 years ago, since this year. 2015 divided by the years that Jesus was when he was crucified gives you the year 2015. This is 1985 years ago. Jesus was age 30. He started his ministry. Jesus was crucified at age 33. So taking a year that Jesus started his ministry. In Palestine, when he was baptized by John the Baptist, at age 30. Clearly, you can make out 2015. Jesus is coming this year. It's conclusive. I have so much proof that I show. I contacted the government. It went in one hand out the other. I contacted the FBI. It went in one out the other. I contacted the National Security Agency. It went in one out the other. Contacted Bill Gates, who went in one ear and out the other. I tried to contact Oprah Winfrey, who went in one out the other. I tried to contact Channel 7 News, they hung up on it. But clearly, what I'm showing you is the truth. It's the prophet Ramon Keith showing you that if you take all the years it's been since he started his ministry at age 30, and you divide that by the age Jesus was when he was crucified. Clearly, he shows you conclusively that 2015, 2015. And the 15s you see is 15 degrees is one hour on earth. At 315, Jesus is going across. 45 degrees. And the 6th and 9th hour, age 43. For the salvation of the souls of the 144,000 that he was going to redeem from the earth. 2015 is conclusive. It's conclusive that Jesus is coming this year. God bless. God bless. Looking at this number, this is 1,985 years ago since 2015. See all the 15s, everybody. This is taking all the, the years it's been since Jesus started his ministry at age 30. And you see all the 15s. One degree on earth is 15 degrees. If you take that number 5, 10, 15, 20, you see it's the 20. All the fives, those four fives add up to 20. And you see the 60s, 60 point, 15, 15, 15, 15, and 2. Clearly, God has shown me to show you 2, 0, 15, 2015. Inclusively, Jesus, who at the age of 33, in the year 33 AD, who started his ministry at age 30, is coming this year in 2015. To judge the world as he was judged. He would separate the sheep from the goat, one on his left, one on his right. And then from this number, you can clearly make out the 5, the 13, the 31. It gives you the feeding numbers when multiplied 2015. This is no coincidence, guys. This is a fact. Jesus is coming this year. The government doesn't want me to let you know it. They mess with my YouTube accounts, they mess with my Facebook accounts. The government doesn't want me to share this with you, but I'm going to share this with you and I'm going to let you know 
Jesus is coming this year. It's a fact. It's not a mistake. And it could be as close as April of this year. Which is the month of Nisan in the Hebrew calendar. Wake up everybody. Pay attention to these videos. Watch my videos. God is showing me to show you. The time is very close. God bless. God bless. God bless.